everybody, it's Michelle Visage, and welcome to another episode of Whatcha Packin'? We are joined by this stunningly beautiful and extremely talented Miss Fame! <laughs> Hi. Hello, darling. Thanks for coming over. Oh, thanks for having me. Yeah. Have any tea? Did you put the kettle on? Oh, yeah, of course, girl. <laughs> Was that microwave hot? <laughs> so here we are together, Fame. What a journey you had. Yeah. <laughs> How was it for you? It was hard. It was the hardest thing I've ever done. Honestly, I've never I've never competed for anything. I've never put myself into a place where I'd have to be judged against another for a talent. And this is the first time where I was putting my I miss fame the identity that I created with her into a room full of other people that are talented you know we very all, talented this very season talented. is sickening so we were talking about a little bit about fashions let's see a little <laughs> bit of what you dresses. <laughs> I know I want to get to some fashion and these gorgeous gorgeous um, drawings but before yeah. we get into these show me what you didn't get a chance to wear um, this is my executive realness look we always have an executive realness look every, every season, season. And this is like a power suit. It's got the, as you said, mullet tail. Yeah, which I'm not skirt. a fan of. But but on me, it would have looked on. much back. It's because it's a pencil. Yeah, 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 yeah. If it wasn't a pencil, it's these flowy mullet. I can't deal with it. That's really beautiful. It fits me like a glove. It looks my ass looks unbelievable. It tucks right under my fanny. It looks right. Sickening. This is really about the belt, though. Yeah, she's the cute. belt. It was something I know you'd wear that with pride. Did you stud it? No, girl. No. You, I don't. No, 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 no. Yeah, but this is E6000 you could do, but these are all sewn on. Oh, they're all sewn yeah. on. This is really couture. Now, obviously, you've got your drag thing. You're doing your drag thing. Yeah. You're going to continue being a makeup artist. I think you inspire so many people, so many kids, so many yeah. drag queens, so many makeup artists look up to you as a makeup artist. And you have a lot of followers on YouTube, don't you? Yeah, it's weird. I mean, I only have a few videos up, but it's only because of, I. you know, how do you cultivate a miracle? Uh, how do I make all this happen when there's no money to back it? That's always been my issue, but I've always been really masterful about making my future Well, if happen. you believe the money will be there, the yes. money will be there. So if you make these videos and you know, I promise you, yeah. because you're, you're, you have oh, a you lot of talent. Me, <laughs> they do, but you can get more and more and more. Yeah. What did your lipstick message mean? Um, I said something polite with the girls. I just said, I think it was something about having integrity and being inspiring. I left the message that I wanted for myself to leave to have on print. I wanted to leave them with what I, my intentions were in this competition. You are here for the crown and $100,000. That's one huge element of this competition. But in the midst of getting there, try to do something inspiring for the planet. My thing is like, I really wanted to elevate drag and bring it to the, I want to bring it to daytime. I want to bring it to Vogue. I wanted to bring it to Patrick DeMar, Chalier, Stephen Mystel, Stephen Klein, Jean-Paul Gaultier. I want to bring my aesthetic there to be in the magazines as a drag queen in fashion, as a face of fashion, as a face of a cosmetics launch, like where people are like, I want your interpretation. I love it. You know? And yeah. that's where I'm Go at, get it. Go you know? get it. I totally see that happening. You're part of our family now. Everybody's going to know you. We're super proud of you. Thank you so much. Everybody's going to love you, and they're going to be stunned and living and gagging every week by the way that you look. So, Thank you. super, super proud of you. I like my insides, too. Love your insides. <laughs> Wish we saw more of your insides. But now I know more of your insides, and I absolutely love them. So, thank you, thank you for joining me. And thank you, everybody, for joining us for another episode of What You Pack In. And we will see you next week here on logotv.com. Bye. Bye.